Hello everyone, it's Operific and welcome back to another video. Today I'm bringing you guys another part on Super Mario 3D World. And today's video is going to be different because if you haven't noticed, I'm by myself. If you guys didn't know, we normally play multiplayer on this game. But just for this part, I'm going to be playing by myself and I'm going to explain because I have a lot to talk about. Which is really important because if you guys don't remember from the last episode, we beat the main game, the story, Beat World 8. And we unlocked the newer worlds, you know, the extra levels. So right now we're currently in World Star. Let me get into it right now. This is our save right here, World Star. And you're probably wondering why I have triple crown lies, all those stars and all those stamps when we didn't have that in the last episode. I'm going to explain. <sighs> so let's get into it. And I'm going to be playing Rosalina. Yes, we unlocked Rosalina. <sighs> yes, you're probably confused. Like, you didn't have all this before. What's going on? Allow me to explain. So as you can see, as I'm showing you right now, we completed this entire world. Attack and toad level, all this. And if you look over here, we got a new rocket that continue onward to like, what is it? I think it's World, yeah, World Mushrooms next. And you're probably wondering, how come we didn't, you know, record this episode together? Because we did do all this together. But the thing is, yeah, I did record it. But when I was editing it, you know, I finished the whole thing, I uploaded to YouTube, and I realized I uploaded the wrong file, and my laptop ran out of space. So what I usually do, I'm trying to, you know, think of this while, you know, playing at the same time, because I'm not really good at multitasking, explaining stuff while focusing on playing games and stuff but yeah so I ran out of space and one way I you know fix that issue is I would delete like the main file from the game capture and it doesn't matter because as long as you uh, have have uh, the project in iMovie you know it saves everything so um, I just realized I want to explain some stuff while I'm, that happened in the level as well I'm doing this with, anyway so let me actually stop and talk a little bit so, actually, no, I'm gonna keep going. But yeah. So I saved the project in iMovie, and I have everything there. So what I was gonna do is just delete the recording from Elgato and keep the original file in there. So I deleted it, so it got more saves in my laptop. I copied it, I deleted the media from um, iMovie, for those who know how iMovie works. I just copied it and then deleted the media to, you know, restore my storage. I got my storage back, and I copied and pasted it back into the movie, you know, back into the project for it. And it, everything was there, but because I didn't have the original file on my game capture anymore, it was just a black screen. So no audio, no game music, it's just a, and not even like gameplay, just a black screen. So I tried to do everything to get it back. I tried to you know see if I could. It was like a way I can restore like my recently deleted uh, saves, and I don't, I don't have to ignore that cloud. It's just a start up there. I was just gonna see if there was like a way for me to, you know, restore my deleted uh, Elgato stuff. But they say once you delete something from Elgato, like your Elgato library, it's gone forever. I tried to regain the YouTube video that I deleted. That I deleted the wrong file. Like I, like once or twice I put the wrong file, I instantly deleted. I honestly sort of uh, kept it there just in case. But I didn't because I didn't think I didn't think something like this would happen. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I should I should put in the cat though. But yeah. So I deleted it as soon as there was, and then I went back and did all that, but yeah, I messed up, and I, I just won't have any trace of the episode we did. We took on the whole entire, uh, this whole entire world, and now I have nothing to show for it, from what we did. So what I thought was I'm just going to come back here, record the episode by myself, which I haven't done in a while. It's been actually a long time since I actually recorded, you know, a gameplay series video by myself. I mainly just been doing it, you know, with my family. Which has been pretty fun, but you know, it brings it back to when I used to make, you know, episodes of me playing by myself. And I can't believe I lost the cat or like that. Should have just went with the fire flower until I got to the certain part. But yeah, I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna come in here. Oh my gosh, so dumb. I'm just gonna come in here and record the episode of me taking on the world and just explain some stuff. That's some stuff that happened because it was a pretty funny episode. The episode was like an hour and 13 minutes long. I'm gonna jump right here. Ah. But yeah, the episode was like an hour and 13 minutes long. It was just pure chaos. It was so loud. There was a whole lot of arguments. People were, you know, we were having our petty disputes. Well, when I say we, I mainly, I mainly mean, you know, my brother, my two brothers and my cousin. They were going at it. Uh, I was just trying to play the game, but I just got caught in the crossfire. Trying to, I was like, I was like the peacemaker. While they were, it was like playful f fighting. Except that, you know, my youngest brother took it very serious because he takes this game very serious for some reason. It's like... We're playing, this is obviously a team game, but he plays it like he's playing it by himself. And the thing is, he has this game on his Switch. And, you know, he already beat the main story. I don't know if he took on the extra worlds, but... Yeah, I'll have to keep, you know, drilling into him that this is a team game. He can't play by himself. He can't be keep, like, running off and forgetting his collectibles, because we need those. You know, to progress to other levels and stuff. Oh, wow. 
Is this really gonna be the whole level? Just me failing? Nah. I, I, I can get it. I gotta get past this part, but yeah. I got to do a lot of cutting, but the only reason I'm not cutting now is because you know I have a lot to talk about. But yeah, I have to keep throwing that into him. It was, it was a whole thing. I really wish I can save a video, man. It was so good. And I have to just you know, do it by myself because I'm pretty sure they're not gonna wanna play this world over again just for a recording. So that's why I'm doing it. And I'm hoping that I can beat this in the time, man, because I actually have some other stuff to do. I have some other videos I wanna record. Let me get this real quick. Probably shouldn't, you know, because I actually want to spin. And when I have the fire flower, it's Rosalina. I can't use the spin anymore. But it's nice that Rosalina has like a like an option to attack instead of just jumping when she's in her base, you know, non powerless form. That's what I like about him. Plus, you know, the spin gives her an extra boost of airtime, just like the, the Mario Galaxy game. Okay, we can do this. So, as I continue on with the uh, levels and stuff. Okay, careful. Yes, there we go. We finally got it. Alright, as I continue on levels and stuff, I'll talk about certain moments that happened that from what I remember. Because we recorded the episode, what? The time I'm recording this is August 8th, Monday. And we played Saturday, it was. I mean, it might as well have been Sunday because. Boom. And there we go. Easy. I mean, my, I might as well say Saturday because we started recording at like 20 minutes before midnight. And, you know, the rest of the time was just, you know, midnight Sunday. So, yeah. Whatever, however you take it. It was made like one or two days ago. So, yeah, not that long ago, but. From what I remember, I say that my memory isn't that great, but yeah, should not underestimate as much. But yeah, we're gonna continue onward. But yeah, I, man, I, I I don't know how many levels this uh, world has, but we struggled so much on this. Like it was ridiculous. I can't believe the spin doesn't work on this side. But yeah, this level in particular with the turning platforms, it was a nightmare. But I have a feeling that some of these levels will be easier just because it's one person. But you know, some segments will be hard because. Something like the last level in this world, it made it easier. Well, I can't believe this happened. I ran back, but she didn't. Okay. But yeah, but some of the segments in this world went easier because we had multiple people, you know, cover more ground and, you know, discover more stuff, like, quicker and stuff like that. But that's the downgrades of playing games like this. Like, you play by yourself, it's easy, but the hard at the same time. And the same thing for the multiplayer. It's like some aspects are easy, but some of them, like, the simple stuff is just super hard. At least I can spend this guy. Yeah, this was the level that we unlocked those needed, by the way. We, we were all like, oh, my gosh, I actually can't wait till the speed boost comes back up because I'm a princess, and the princess in this game is like, the run speed is just not it, please! I'm so lucky, bro. There we go. Boom, spin. I do not want to die here. We had so much trouble getting to this part in particular, but eventually we did get it. And now, just like that, boom. I'm here. When it took us like forever to reach this part. Like so much, like, we, we died so much times here, we even got the, oh yeah, speaking of dying so many times, the amount of game over we got during that was just ridiculous. But yeah, we even, like on certain levels, we got, you know, the box where the game gives you that, that uh, item box, what was it, that, uh, that invincible leaf, yeah, it's when you die too many times. Like, it, it got that ridiculous. It really helped us in the last level, which I'll talk about, oh, hold on. Can I, like... <sighs> if only I had the cat, though. I can't... Okay, I'll have to come back for that. I mean, I would do what I did last time, because, you know... Like, even before this, uh... I don't know if you guys know this, but... What I would... What I did was went back... After we, uh, completed the main game, I just went back and, like... Got all the extra stuff, like, all the st extra stars and stamps that we missed. Like, off camera. I might just do the same for here. And, oh my gosh, what was that? How did I get that much speed and when I jumped, I just straight the other way. Okay, I don't know, but continue onward. Also, let me talk about the lives, actually, because you're probably wondering how we have this many lives when before we barely even had 100. Well, basically, I did, we didn't have this when we played, like, before we just had our regular lives. I'm still talking about after we uh, did a recording for this world, of playing this world. I actually went off camera and did, like, that little uh, World 1, Level 2 uh, exploit where I got all these lives, that one-up trick. The reason being is I'm tired of uh, seeing the game over stream. So I was like, you know what? So next time we play, we can just, you know, die and skin. Continue on with the level. I can't believe that that just happened. <sighs> like, it's not that hard to be honest. It's just I'm being super impatient. And that's a problem. But yeah, that's why I have this many lives. So I don't know the specifics of it, but all I know is that we have over a thousand. Over a thousand one hundred lives to work with. I'm not gonna waste all of them with this gameplay. It's easy, we're gonna do this. 
We have no power ups this level. I'm gonna jump over this guy. I'm gonna wait for that to flip. I have to wait for the star to come back up. Because this is the star we missed, because I remember we got a, we were like on the last life and my brother Corey, he was the only one alive. And he was like running out of time too, so he just rushed and you know forget it. Or I think I don't even think it's because he rushed. I think it's because he just didn't want he just wanted to get the level over. He was tired of this level, so let me see this level. And look, this is observatory in the background. And she would be standing right here. She was like standing right here. And then when we when I went to level. I'm about to be here. Sorry. But this is my flag now. Yeah, he would drop the flag and Rosalie would jump in and do a little dance and pose. And then once we got the level, he'll say, hey, you unlocked Rosalina, nice. And my brother, my youngest brother, Evan, he was like, oh, I want to do Rosalina. But I was like, nah. Because me and my younger brother is fighting for Rosalina because, you know, it's a new character. But I was like, you know what? I deserve Rosalina because they've been playing all eight worlds. With characters with like certain like abilities, I've just been playing plain old Mario. There's nothing special about Mario other than the fact that he's like the easiest and basic to control. Oh my gosh, this level this was hectic. But yeah, I got Rosalina because he tried to do the switch thing, but I got it faster. I did it faster than him. So, oh look, look how simple this level is going with just one person. I think I got a, you know, a feel of how the wheel works. Okay, check it for everything because now I can go at my own pace now that I'm by myself. So I can, you know, look out for secrets and stuff like that. Hmm, Alright, there's nothing here. I wonder if there's, they put it on... Uh, if the stamp was under there, it would be glowing. I'll check it out. Oh, I didn't mean to check, turn the camera. She sounds nice messing up. Let me see, can I just do this by just walking? I can. So you don't even have to run. Okay, that box would just be a uh, one-up and a uh, star. Don't need that. Oh, get out of here. Okay, I wonder if I had a cat can just climb up the walls. Okay, hopefully we're in the middle so those guys can't reach us. That's really close though. See, it's this simple. Huh? If it's this simple, I don't understand why we had so much trouble, you know, with it. But I guess because everybody's panicking or whatever. Didn't even get to check this because I'm pretty sure for this to work, everybody's to be standing on here. But one person's not going to work. And look, there's Luigi over there on that wall. That looks like a house. Yeah, the gold all the way over there. They didn't get the top of the gold pole because we were rushing to it. Alright. Got a checkpoint. It's amazing how smoothly this level goes when you're just one person. Right, right down there was a star. I don't need that because I already have it. But also, I do remember there's a certain section this stuff I have to look out for. I saw a little platform that would acquire uh, some people, like multiple people. Let me get this to be out this way. He's making me nervous. Keep doing this, okay. That's got everything. Got one this way. Got one. Okay, now we can come here. Come on. A little bit. Boom. Okay, okay, keep going, keep going. Ooh. Alright, alright. Still kind of nervous, though. So. Turn. It's really close, alright. Get out of the way. Excuse me. Yeah, it's that little coin area. Let's try to see, look over. We need two people for that. Maybe I can cheat this. Hold on. Uh, come over here. Oh, dang, I just hit it. But we do have a mushroom. Hold on. Pop the mushroom. Take his eye out. I'm gonna pause. I'm gonna get my Joy Con. Wait. Do I have an extra control down here? I don't think I think he took his pro control upstairs. But I'm gonna take a Joy Con from my uh, Switch and see if I can activate another character. And join me on this. Uh, no matter who it is, we just need another person. Where's Toad at? Perfect. Easy. And we should. Oh, so extra time and us the last star. Nice. Alright. We don't need you anymore. How do I hang on? This would be the pause button. Oh no. This is the pause button. We need to take a counter there. Alright, there we go. Took that out, easy, and you should be going away. Sometime soon. But now you can jump down here on this platform. Just do a long jump, and I don't know why it's still here, but Oh man, long jump. Now it's a golden. See you, Blue Toad. Don't need you anymore. You should go away sometime. But yeah, that level was like we spent an absurd amount of time on some of these levels. Like it's ridiculous. And you see, I got one person now. I honestly thought I was gonna struggle on that, but yeah. I'm trying to think, like, remember like all the levels that we did in this world. I think the one level I'm gonna have a lot of uh, difficulty with is what's it called? Blue Toad. 
is the last level in this world, which you'll see. We'll eventually get to it. But continuing on with the great goal pole. Oh my goodness, this was an adventure. Let's go. <sighs> so, we, of course we died a lot in here. Chasing the pole and whatever. Even I had uh, Marcus change his character to Mario because he was, you know, not happy with how slow Peach was running. And yeah, we got to the point where I was like, no, nah, we can 100% sell. We can get all the all the stars and stamps easy. And I was like, I was trying to, Ivan, you're the fastest character in the game. Chill out. Slow down and, you know, get, we got this. But he kept going like super fast and keep jumping on the pole even though we had to, we weren't even at the part with the green star yet. So it kind of got mad and I was like, okay, I just took him out the game. I'm like, just wait, bro, because <laughs> we got to do this. But every time I was like, come on. Let's go. Uh, Evan, you can run, but just don't jump on the flag, and he just jumps on when he got close to it. So yeah, I just take him out for like just this level. Keep chasing you. I'm gonna chase you to the end, because I'm gonna get that gold flagpole. That's all I need. But yeah, it was ridiculous. A lot of fun moments from this level, too. She's hard to go for. Ah, dang it. I honestly thought I can land that, but yeah, I'll have to get a gold flagpole next time. Gotta come back in this level with a gold, I said gold, with a cat bell. And I don't know, run with somebody faster. But, you know, to unlock the last world, the last world of this uh, game, you have to get golden flagpoles on all the world's levels, so that's gonna be something. Yeah, we can do it though. Especially with the speed boost they gave us in this version of 3D World, because if you guys didn't know, the Switch version of what, in, like how the characters control and stuff like that. I wanna see, can I actually? Nah, it's just bricks. They don't hide anything under you. It's like if I ground pound, I'm just gonna fall to my death. But yeah, they updated the character speeds in this. Uh, this level. Look, a secret. We got a super leaf. Somebody just texted me. Sorry about that, no that notification there. But last time I checked, there was like nothing up here. And I wish I had the cat bill. Probably see if I can stop off at like an, a mushroom house. See if I can get one. Oh my goodness, who's texting me? Sorry about the noise. But yeah, this level was. We didn't struggle on this level, but it did take a little bit because we didn't get nothing from here because everybody just kept rushing ahead and going at their own pace. And I can actually, you know, I'm not actually search for stuff. Oh, we got the guy. Right. Okay, hold on. There we go. Let's see if we can find a, some type of secret star or. What's it called? Star or stamp? Surprised I haven't, like, hit myself by accident. Oh, look. Secret. I guess it's gonna contain a one mushroom. Hit it. Alright, there we go. If I just hit my regular tail because the rolling isn't even working. I wonder if I can, like, if I ground pound it, I can just break it in one hit, right? Oh, look, it's time. Can I need to roll here? No. Okay, so I'm not gonna ground pound there. Let's try it. Oh, okay, these guys just break through instantly. How can I forget? Gotta hit them. Excuse me. Boom. Alright. We could leave the guy over here, but I just wanna. Okay, so. Still multiple hits, but I just go faster. Me. Let's go up here and see what we created as a staircase, but I think that- Oh yeah, that leads to the box, which gave us a star, so I don't need to worry about that. The stamps here, though. Let's get this guy out the way, though. Does that feel safe with him around? Alright, boom. Stamp. Can't believe we missed that stamp so easily, but considering the fact everybody's doing their own thing, going at their own pace, it's kind of understandable. So there's a stand for that, then we just need to find the extra green stars. And if we don't find it here, I'll find it off camera. Because, yes, there's an extra world we have to do to, uh, you know, get everything to unlock the extra world. I think I think that's highly unlikely that we're, I'm actually going to have the patience to do all that, but I'll try. I think the the one thing I'm not looking forward to is getting a gold flagpole with every single character. And sheesh, who keeps texting me? I gotta, okay, I gotta pause for a second, hold on. Alright, we're back. Sorry about that. I just put my phone on silent and just told my brother to, you know, keep it down because he's upstairs playing Smash Bros. and I can't believe I just missed that. In my defense, the arc is kind of... Okay, there we go. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's a second star. Now we just need the last one. Alright. So I was in this area where I have to find all these uh, stuff. And, oh my goodness. Okay, yeah. Come over here. I just gotta leave these guys at this level because I do not have the patience to break all this. Uh, okay, nothing else. Can we jump up here though? I barely get up there, but I don't think there's anything. Yeah, there's not anything of importance up here, unless there's like, I don't know, later in the level. We'll see. Alright, there's a Bowser box that uh, spawns bombs. Oh, perfect. Oh my goodness, again, a little too close, bro. What's this down here? Oh, it's the other uh, thing. 
Boom. What's this? Staircase for the last one. Oh yeah, the star should be over there. I actually remember we went to that box. And once we went in the box, I'm like, wait, there's the last star over there. Yeah, I see it. But I can barely reach it. I have to break it, though. Let's come here. Boom. I can jump on this Bowser box and get up here easily. Boom, boom. I'll just have to ground pound that. But because it blew up, I just have to wall jump. Now we got everything. All we gotta do is get the gold flagpole. Boom. Boom. And long jump. You don't even have to jump. Let's see if you can execute long jump perfectly. Boom. You're gonna get the flagpole every single time. As long as you hit the right platform and pull it. Also, I find it hilarious how, you know, the princesses fit their dresses in the Tanuki suit. I remember back in the day when the game was still new, everybody was talking about, you know, making memes and talking about, wow, they have a, <laughs> they have a big butt because of the suit, but now it's just their dress. Uh, 2013, 2014 was a simpler time, especially compared to today. I don't need a slot machine anymore because look at my lives. The Toad, Captain Toad level. I mean, might as well just get that over with. It's going to be interesting with one person. A lot more thinking. But, oh yeah, I can switch the Toads, but uh, I'll just stick to regular Red Toad. But yeah, there's all the stars. I'm just get them. Show you guys. So we're making a whole bunch of references level because we have to push the P button. If you guys don't know the internet, me, you know, push and P in that song. I don't think anybody would get it. My audience would get it, but I don't know. So first, this is our first star. I'll come over here. Actually, go on my own pace. Turn the camera how I want. Just view the level. So there's a star down there. You might as well. Boom. Come around here. Where's the other P? It's over there. Boom. Kind of fall here. So now we can access that. Oh dang. Should have actually went across more. But there should be another star down here, right? Or is it? Oh no, it's up there. Okay. But right. well, we can actually come up there though. No problem. So let's come up here real quick. Sheesh, you're so slow. I wonder if they updated Captain Toad's speed. I mean, I guess it wouldn't make sense. That's my theory. So there ain't no way you update everybody's speed but the captain's. Oh, I should've waited. But it doesn't matter. You can do this. Boom. Push P one more time. I'm not sure if they get that star down. Push it a few more times. Please don't. Okay. I'm gonna see where I was falling. We got this. We got this. Just be careful. Okay, the star is there. Push P right here. I hate how he doesn't move when he's falling. I guess that's just part of the puzzle. And I'm pretty sure didn't, uh, yeah, he did. Captain Toad got this whole spin-off game. Uh, this puzzle thing. Okay, now we're on the bottom. Now we can get the star. Got his little spin-off game based on this mini game. And I don't really plan on getting it. It's a cool little thing, but yeah. Wow, I was right there by the star. But it doesn't matter, because that was the last star anyway. That's all five stars. I'm not doing that over again, because yeah, we already have everything. So yeah, that's a, that level. Now we can continue onwards. Alright, thank you. Goodbye, Captain Toad. Also, if you didn't know, this thing right here is not a mushroom house. It was a Sprixy house, which gave me... Which stamp it was it? Can I look at it? Oh, look at my stamps. It was the Cat Mario... No. Yeah, it, it had to be. Yeah, it was a Cat Mario, like, climbing on the left. For sure it was that one. Alright, now we have this level, which we basically got everything, surprisingly. But uh, yeah, this is pretty hectic too. I remember struggling on this a lot. Like this, everybody was uh, getting kind of mad on this. Well, why I say everybody, I mean uh, Evan, my youngest brother. And, yeah. I'm, I Also, I just remember from the third level, there was a certain part uh, where my brother just ground pounded me for no reason. I was like, what are you doing? And he said, oh, I didn't realize I... Like, you not... But yeah, he's got to focus my broke ground behind it and I just died. How many times did that happen before? The pressure's not the first. I don't know if you guys noticed, because even though the series, like, the part 8 of the series didn't come out for you long, not too long ago, like, like, August something. It was like August 5th? Sheesh. I'm telling you, my memory's not the greatest. But yeah, even though that the last episode of that came out, like, August 5th, we recorded that all the way back, like, near the beginning of July. So I'm telling you. Keep that in mind. So if my memory isn't, you're wondering why I'm not remembering something that, that came out recently, because we didn't record it recently. It's constantly mind though, because some people don't know that I record videos like on a certain day and I just don't release it till like a certain time. 
Oh no, I should have. Dang, I should have kept the Tamaki. If you guys didn't know here, there's this other section here, and you kill all these guys with the boomerang, this uh, another star will unlock. Come back, and then. That's pretty sure that's the second star. Trying to get that. Oh man, if I died there, I would have been so mad. Wait for the platform store here. There we go. Alright. And yeah. You're probably wondering as to why. Oh, I just killed that piranha plant off screen. Right, these fire piranhas. You're probably wondering why, as to, you know, I'm playing by myself, like, I have the option to, like, play any character I want. Well, Rosalina's new, and I actually like playing with her. The only thing I don't like about her is her, her movement speed. But yeah, I don't really care about the others. I've been playing basic Mario for so long, you know, I gotta change it up. Like, literally, uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, I don't think I mentioned it before. But we had a failed recording. Well, not really a failed recording, it's just that, uh, okay. goodbye, man. It's just a scrap recording. Like, the first time we... Well, for the series, from what you guys see, if you look at the first episode and you see when I recorded it, we recorded the first episode of this in May. But that's not really true. I just said May. We recorded the first episode of this in July, but that's not really true because the first time we actually recorded a video on this game of us playing together with Luigi was actually in May. Uh, it was during a weekday, and this is when school was still in session, so, you know, not everybody at the time. But we we played Mario Kart for a bit, then we switched to 3D World, and we played like two levels, and then we just stopped. Let's see if we can get up here. Already, even though we already have the gold flat pole, but we didn't do this in the gameplay. I just luckily got it, because I just jumped into the spin and got it. But yeah. What was I talking about again? I was talking about the uh, scrap recording. I, I say scrap, but it's still on my laptop. I was thinking of just uploading it as an like, unlisted video, because you guys just want to see it. But yeah, we did like two levels, and then we left it, but I didn't want to, you know, continue off, because... Literally, we didn't record another part until like two months later, so you know, we just did a new game to, you know, refresh our memory. Well, mainly for Marcus, because he never played this game before. But yeah. And oh boy, this level. I remember having kind of dispute with Evan on here. Because, I don't know, he was mad at somebody. <laughs> Pretty much mad at all of us, but mainly Marcus. And once we got into this level, he just kept running ahead. And there's a certain power up, which you're going to see very soon. Hold on. What's this? I thought we were like a one up in there for some reason. So, like, whenever I think of, like, hidden uh, question mark blocks in Mario games, I automatically think one up at this point. But yeah, it was just a certain section where we got the Mega Mushroom. He just kept going forward. He jumped in, jump up here to get that stamp I just got. I just remembered that it was there. And has Rosalina always had purple fingernails? I just never seen that. I played, I played Galaxy back in, what was it? I think it was May? Or July? No, it was June. I think I fin I think I started it in June, uh, May, and I finished it in June. But yeah, that's odd. I don't think I don't think uh, Rosalina always had purple nails. That has to be like new or something. Got super leaf. I'll take that. But actually, I'll stick with the blue one for now because we're about to go underwater. But yeah, he got he just kept rushing ahead, missing stars, missing stamps, and we had to restart the level. And later on, there would be certain times where something he sees something in the level, and I didn't go after it. And then he'd be like, oh, so when I do something, it's a problem. We start a level, but when y'all miss something, it's like, oh, now you restarted? But I'm like, there's a difference because you're rushing ahead and missing all the easy collectibles we can collect. And the collectibles he was going after, it was kind of, it was kind of different in a way. It's kind of like you need a certain item for something, and we didn't have any more, like, star power, which is going to be in the level we're going to see. I'm going to talk about it in a little bit, but anyway. Let's continue on with it. Come up here, and if you guys know, you know. Bring me up, please. And we this thing we come up here. Okay, jump and break that brick I did. Alright, we're good. Because if you didn't know, that's how we got the last star. And then we come up here. The last star is up there. It's just a, like a whole little thing for blue coins. But continue on the regular path. And there we go. We got these sleeping Goombas here. I wonder if I can just uh, long jump on them. Okay, of course not. It doesn't matter because you know, I already have the gold flagpole for Rosalina there. But at least I got an extra one up because of the, all those Goombas there. Thought I was gonna long jump and land on the Goomba's head, then get enough air time to, you know, hop on the flagpole, but just barely. If they were just a little further, it would have been nice, but nah. But yeah, this is the level that we were talking about. He was getting really mad. He had an attitude. Like, I had to pause yeah, on the last level to, you know, because I was tolerating it because I knew, we, you know, he's talking to us in a way where he doesn't usually talk to us. It's getting kind of rude and disrespectful. And, you know, I'm the older brother, so I had to let him know, hey, you gotta watch your tone. Like, playing the game. 
shouldn't have like get you this mad and plus we're all playing for fun you, you might we might do something that you didn't like but hey he done plenty of stuff that we don't like and we still tolerate it but so it's like now that the fact that and it's like hey yeah, he's gotta cut it out it was ridiculous but yeah just a whole little open section area here we gotta get these things Let's see, we, don't, we didn't even get a stamp here, we just got the last star. Okay, so we gotta check everything. See, a section like this is gonna suck because I'm only one person. And I don't ha I can't cover that much ground. So I really gotta check everything. The trees, everything. But we're kinda all over the place, so at least I can actually get to this time. I wonder if ground pounding the uh, tombs is anything. There's, an, uh, there's a tomb here, you know, that's ground poundable. But it's kinda, you know obvious as to why you want to ground pound it. So I'm just checking these other ones to see if there's like any secrets. I don't think so. Get this power block. Okay, complete miss. We can hit this guy, right? Yes, we can. We might as well. Pick the snowball up and then... Oh, dang it. Alright. These guys are really respawn, because if so, I hope I'm not doing this for like no reason. Okay. Yeah, all these doors here, these teleporting doors, they tell you, like, take you around the map I'm just gonna go by foot and yeah as you can see hold on let me spin that away hold on got you if I can hit him with my regular spin only I can just take him out my spin side of eating a snowball but there we go we got a fire flower frozen I like the red dress on Rosalina plus I like how she puts her hair in a ponytail it was this part right here with Captain Toad all these ghosts and I got star power pop ha, southern I got star power earlier and I used it up but I didn't come to Toad while he was calling my attention he got mad I'm like, hey, calm down. We can always get it back, like, go back in the level and get it back later. But he's like, oh, but when I miss stuff you, and you just go back and like, start the level because I missed it, I'm like, oh, that's different because you're rushing. Here, it was an honest thing that I didn't see, even though, you know, because he was getting talked over because Corey and Mark was having a conversation and I just missed it because I was just trying to play the game. But yeah, let's take the star power and just run over there real quick. So, Evan, if you're watching, here. Happy night. Oh, wow. I think he's gonna give us a star. Yes, sir. Ooh, uh, got a little star power flip as the regular was gonna. Right, here we go. We have a power block here, which we can't spin anymore, so we gotta grab a snowball for this. Okay, there's that, the fourth one, and then we gotta now. Lastly, we gotta check one of these. Oh, look, uh, time thing. I'll take that. Spending a long, whole lot of time here. We just gotta open one of these doors and hope to get on the platform in the top right. That takes me there. Come here. Okay, that's not it. Ah, okay. I didn't know that wasn't gonna be my way. Okay, this has to be the door then. Yes, it is. And there we go. Uh, we missed a little, it's a middle star apparently. I don't know where the stamp is. Hmm. Let's check this area one more time. There has to be a checkpoint in this level, right? I honestly can't remember. Because this level went by so fast. No, I think there was like a certain part where we could like climb up in here. Like maybe. I don't know, somewhere. I'm checking the wall and stuff just in case. See if I move my camera. I know I'm running low on time. I'm just trying my best to, you know, be super quick with it. Just double checking now. Alright, I don't know. We'll just go continue on with the level, hopefully. Oh no, I remember. Uh, the middle store, the, 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 the middle star. Thing is, I'm confused on how to get it. Alright. No stamp. Okay, that's a little bit worrying. Actually, I'm gonna take this. Kind of running low on time. Oh wait, never mind. There's a time thing right here. Nice. All right, he's gonna fall down. I remember there was a certain where the other star was in this level. It just came to me. Jump, jump. Even though we're max health right now, when I say health, I mean max lives. Yeah, I still enjoy getting coins. Excuse me. The one on the box on the left is the fake. It's this part right here. Um, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to kick it around and the star's supposed to appear? Like, I don't, I don't understand. Let's look at a guide because I did do it like that level like years ago and I got it, but it's been like how many years since I last played Wii U before I got it from my Switch? So obviously I don't remember. So we're going to have to see how it's going to work. What's this on the left? It has to be a stamp. Yeah, because we saw this on the left. 
I mean, I said the left. We saw us on the right, but Evan was rushing ahead. So we missed something that we easily could have gotten. So that's just another example. Uh, and we have this huge open area. Uh, we don't really check it because we're not really uh, missing anything because we got all the collectibles and stuff. But I don't know, maybe is there a way to, if we uh, collect everything, we just get a way to, I don't know, to reach the top? Because Evan, once Evan saw the flag, he just ran up and just jumped on it. Oh, look, it's clouds. Jump on. Alright, in the middle. Oh, that just messed me up. I honestly thought, you know, when it went down for that little bit, I was going to miss it. But we still got the gold flagpole, but I'm mad because we lost our Tanuki power-up, and I prefer to have that over the fire flower. Uh, hey, what you going to do about it? Got her stamp. Cat Rosalina. Alright, there's that, and now we're currently the last level for this world. This is the level, which was, oh my gosh, it was so hectic. I remember... I say I remember like it was a long time ago, but it was literally only a few days ago. Oh look, we still have the the item box because we struggle so much on this level. I mean, why not? Just for this, because I want my Tanuki back, and you know, when you play, play a level with this, you know, we actually keep, keep a regular Tanuki. If you want to see, because I don't play with this at all, but this is going to be a little secret. We're on the last level, and we already beat it, so I don't know, let's have a little fun. And yeah, we struggle mainly on this level because, you know, there's going to be certain parts where you have to hit stuff with this brick. And oh my gosh, see how much coins we got from that? Okay, there we go. Now continue onward. Oh yeah, this, we missed a stamp here because nobody stopped here. This is going to be hard on one person because, you know, you normally have most people. So hold on. Stay right there. Get this. Hey, Rumas, I'll be home soon. Can I come on here? Okay, continue onward. There we go. I just realized I'm avoiding these things when I can just let this stuff hit me because I have the Tanuki. The Invisible Tanuki on, which I'm not used to having, because, you know, I'm a real Mario player. I play the game how it's supposed to be. I don't take handouts, but, you know, yeah, just for fun. This one time, I'll take it. Well, I'll say it's one time, but I don't know if I'll ever do it again, but I try not to, because, you know, it makes it more fun. It it's more challenging like this, but, uh, we'll see. Where's the first star? That's my question. Oh, yeah, I remember where the first star is. There's this part right here. Because there was a certain part where I actually had this uh, box on me, but... My brother followed me into the, not the youngest one, Evan, I'm talking about Cory. Like, for some weird reason, he just followed me into the room. That, like, that room that I already broke in, that you saw before, right there on the bottom left. Hold on. Oh, what just, oh, is it because I'm too close? I mean, okay. I mean, just explodes, I gotta I got time it right. I mean, I, I, I didn't struggle on this, like, the first time I did this, like, what, what, how is it exploding there? Is it because I'm facing, okay, let me hold it, because maybe I'm just, like, letting go. Boom. Okay, I press A. But he followed me in the room, just knocked my box off, and he was the only one of us that had the box. And he just, you know, hit me, and then we didn't have the extra ones because everybody lost it. So I was waiting for, oh, it's not lucky. And maybe, so I don't know. But yeah, he was struggling to get up here with the box, and he eventually lost it, so I'm like, yeah. But yeah, the first star would be right here. I would have easily got that, but he knocked the box off my head, and then he lost his, so we had to skip past that. But yeah, basically all, all the collectibles, man. You just missed the first and the stamp. To the first, uh, specifying what it was. The first star I'm talking about, but yeah, common sense. Come on, guys, you got it. I have this, a slow star session where at some point we're gonna get a box. Yeah, these power up boxes. It's not here though. Oh, yeah, once Evan like, got the box, he was talking, but he went instantly targeting Marcus. Like, Evan had it out. Like, Evan was mad at everybody, but he just specifically had it out for Marcus during this playthrough of the world. Like, man, I was talking about revenge. Like, yes, I got it. Like, oh my goodness. Okay. I let him know, like, before we record the next episode, he gotta chill out with that attitude. Because what he displayed was definitely ridiculous, but. Yeah. Well, you know, he's young. Hopefully, you know, he can drop it. And you know, they're having fun with games like this and they wanna win all the time. Of course, he's gonna get like this for kids, I know. Gotta give him that break, but still. It's not a good attitude to have. Gotta teach him that. Has an oldest brother. But, continue onwards. Not even halfway done with the level yet. Now we are. Yes, those item boxes are just extra uh, box heads. This is the part where we have to be careful because now we gotta hit, stop the thing, and hit that thing. I can't believe that just happened. All right, let's retry that. Give me my stuff back. I, I was gonna spin and hit both of the boxes, so it'd been cool to activate them both. But yeah, whatever. 
So yeah, it was this part in particular because we have more people. You know, we have like we have like say like two, it was a part where like two of them were in a bubble. I think it was Marcus and Corey that was in the bubble. It was just me and Evan. And like you know, since there's only two people, it would equal out. And one person would be on each side and just stop the thing completely. But when you're one person, okay, we don't have to hit that because it's changed the tactic at the start, which we already have. But yeah, it would like you know, one person would just um, aim and get the thing, and then we continue onward. There's more boxes. Hit that. Dang. Be careful, cause we can easily fall off here. Boom. There we go. Perfect. All right. And we're doing this without, it's like, there was a certain part of this level where we were on our last life and I was like, okay, forget this, I'm just going to continue on with the leaf because I've been telling you the whole time to avoid it. But it's like, the last life, okay, let me have it. And this is a certain part we got to. Oh my goodness, I might have messed up. Please, please make it, please. Oh, we're not going to make it. Oh, wait, we're not going to make it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I almost fell off there. I shouldn't have jumped, to be honest. Man. But yeah, we got to this part. It was just him and Marcus, and they made it. And it was like the clock was going down, it was like under 100 seconds, and it was pretty stressful, but they made it. And yeah, everyone was bragging the whole time, talking about, oh, we wouldn't have made it if, like, we would have died if I didn't have the Tanuki suit. <laughs> and it was a whole thing. Probably, yeah. But at the same time, it is possible that it wouldn't have happened, but it doesn't matter. All it matters is that we completed the level, and I completed the level here. And I like good. I like the Tanuki design of, you know, the invisible thing and all the white and yellow. I like that color combination. And there's our stamp. How appropriate. And that's the complete entirety of World Star. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay video. I know it was kind of weird, you know, getting all these parts of me playing, us playing this game all together. And that's an episode here by myself. I try my best to, when I record the next episode of this with my family, that I don't do any mess ups and delete the wrong thing again. Because I don't want to do this alone. And yeah, recording alone is cool, but it's more fun when, you know, everybody's around. But yeah, there's that. So next time we'll be taking on World Mushroom, my family, and as you can see in the red platform is World Flower. If you guys don't know, there's that, that little structure in the middle there. That's like the gateway to World, I think it's World Champion? World Crown, I think it is? It's been a year, so I can't remember. But that's the last world, but we have to get everything in the game to access that. Not sure if we will, but only time will tell. But yeah, I'm gonna stop stalling and get out of here, because I have a Mario Kart video to record. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys all enjoyed. I'm so terrific, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.